How frustrating is it for you coming from your own fans? Just how disappointing is that? I have got no idea how people still, or still, or anyway, have ever thought this way. So, uh, yeah, you are. Um, sometimes you think uh, people are smarter than this. Uh, I'm. I'm very convinced it's just a minority, but uh, anyway, it's, uh, it's very wrong. It is a minority, Jan, but it, it just seems like, I don't know, the last year or so, mm. it seems to be getting worse. Um, more, more prevalent. Yeah, I, I don't know if it's, if it's getting worse. Uh, you know, it shouldn't be there in uh, any way, in, in any way. So, um, yeah, it's just... Uh, I just can't get my head around it. How people, how people still, people do this, and uh, yeah, I, uh, yeah, I've got no words for it. And um, you know, uh, if, if any of uh, of their players, of our players, probably, probably their players are affected. You know, uh, you know, yeah, I have to apologize in uh, in name of Spurs, but like I said, these these are not, not minority real, idiots. Not not real Spurs fan, obviously. Uh, no, we we, uh, we don't identify with these people. No. And coming from the, the continent, yeah, do, you, do you feel like this is a problem that's particularly bad in, in English football? Uh, English football is you know, the way I see it. It's it's still everywhere. You know, it's not that uh, in countries where I've where different countries where I've played that uh, there is nothing at all. I always uh, always see. To be fair, I always see England as one of the the countries who's. Who's, uh, who's, who's ahead in uh, in the multicultural uh, society? That's that's why I love London. That's why I love the UK. And um, yeah, fact that that in this country where uh, you know where I think they're ahead of other uh, of other countries, it, it hurts. You know, and uh, it's not just a problem in this stadium or in in, in, in London or in UK, but it's, it's everywhere in the world, and uh, and it's wrong. How do we fix it? Yeah, fix it. Yeah, uh, fix, I don't know how you fix these idiots, but obviously uh, this is uh, an opportunity for the uh, for the right people to to act strong against it, and uh, not just here, not just in this stadium, but in in Belgium, in in Holland, uh, the countries where I watch football. I think it's uh, it's a problem everywhere, and um, and um, yeah, this is an op another opportunity to uh, to make a statement. Two, Two more questions, please, guys. Are on, on the pitch, but are you, as players, are you, are you asking each other what, what's what's happening, what happened that day? That's be fair. I, I didn't know anything, and then I just, uh, you know, I, I heard from some of the guys. So uh, you know, I haven't been really speaking to anyone, but uh, yeah, it will be a topic uh, tonight and tomorrow. Your, t your teammate Last Danny one. has been very vocal about mm -hmm. his feelings about the punishments dished out by the likes of UEFA. Perhaps, do you have a view on it? Do you think they've been strong enough for dealing with this issue? Again, my general feeling is that in England, they're the uh, they act strong, and maybe we act, they have to act even uh, stronger. But I think. Uh, uh, outside of the UK, and then I'm talking about the UEFA and other FAs in in European countries. They uh, yeah, they can do better. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube, and for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN Plus.